Okay, we're back for round two. Uh, game one, we won the roll again. Uh, this time less handily than before. Hopefully that doesn't bode poorly for us. We'll play first. You. This is not a one lander that we can keep. Um, <laughs> it's an island, so we can't even cast Dried Militant, so that's an easy ship back. And a uh, five land hand with only a four drop? Hmm. It's not a good hand either. So we could go down to five. Which is, uh, well, I guess he's choosing the mulligan first. We'll see what he does. Um, yeah. Not excited to go down to five here. All right, well, he kept. Um, you know, at least here we can cast what we draw. Um, so I'm probably going to keep. I don't know. This is kind of dicey. We're on the play, so... Uh, I feel like <clears throat> our mulligans are going to be a little less forgiving for us. Our deck doesn't curve out well anyways. So, you know, we have land... Uh, well, that was a bad draw. Hopefully he doesn't have an explosive start. Um, Dredge Beetle is, I guess, okay. Although him having a two-drop is not good for us. No three-drop one time? This looks like a three drop. No. Slime molding. All right, well that indicates he has some sort of populate effect. Hopefully he doesn't use it next turn. Hopefully this is not the guy with growing ranks. <clears throat> if, uh, actually I guess if he has growing ranks and he just slams it down here, not that that would be good for us. Um, we can probably just bounce this token with Void Wielder and maybe get some time. Hmm. So we could have Rootborn defenses, uh, so I don't want to just play my Void Wielder into it. Don't get much value that way. Bouncing the Dredge Beetle doesn't really do anything. We might be able to just eat it with a uh, Hissar Patrol. He missed a land drop. I like The fact that he just you know slammed down Ooze there uh, makes me think that he has... Um, growing ranks. Pause. Oh, okay, well, now bouncing this token won't do anything anyways. Hopefully we can eat a token here if he slams with everything, which it looks like he is. Um, so we'll drop down our Hussar Patrol and uh, eat the Night Token since it has Vigilance. And then if he plays growing ranks, we can just Void Wielder, although if he has Rootborn Defenses here, Giant Growth is not good. Huh. Alright, another land is not helpful. Um, Alright, well, we'll get in, because we're not blocking next turn with Soul Sword and Spirit, um, and we'll just bounce back his Night Token, I guess. We're pretty much dead, though. Yes, I want to use that ability. now we can block two of the damage, but we need to start drawing real spells ASAP. Keeping a five lander and then drawing three lands, huh, a second giant growth? Alright. Now we're just way dead. Blocking this Lesnia Sentry if he turns everything sideways, which he is. Hopefully he doesn't have a third pump spell, which would, which would just be ridiculous. Seriously? If I was him, I almost would have just like, I don't know, I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Alright, well, that was not a good game for us. Three Giant Gross, and we don't even have any Dispels to deal with it. We have Cancel. There is Downsize, which kind of counters Giant Growth. Do we want to consider putting in Downsize? That's, you know, how he wins. Triple Giant Growth is definitely something. We could take out a Swift Justice, I guess. Swift Justice doesn't do well against Giant Growth. Um, I guess that seems okay. Um, Alright, on to game two. Hopefully it goes a little.